Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Kenneth Bolito, also known as the Tech Guide, and this is a quick video on video calling on iOS via Skype. And it's been a long time since I reviewed the Skype app for the iPod Touch and the iPhone. It's actually been two years ago, and it was the first video launched on the Tech Guide. And yeah, that was a really, really long time ago. But since then, the app has come really far, and today, actually just recently, they enabled video calling on the iOS version of Skype. So we're going to go ahead and demonstrate that right now. I'm going to go ahead and send out a call to my second account, which is my laptop right now. See that it came up. So we're just going to answer that call. And you'll see that the call is going on right now. To enable video calling, all you have to do is press this button and you'll notice that um, this is the screen right here on the iPod Touch that the other uh, side of the call will see and as you can see my laptop is showing that screen we're gonna go ahead and go into landscape mode it shows you a wider view and you'll see that it does the exact same thing now we can go click on the screen we have a dialog here and we can press that button and we could choose to press the back camera so as you can see the back camera is working also I don't know if this is full resolution or not it probably isn't but you could still use the back camera which is pretty cool now of course this works vice versa we're gonna go ahead and turn off this camera and we are going to go to the computer and enable video calling on the computer and the screen down here is what the iPod will see so we're gonna go ahead and use that and as you can see I'm moving my iPod and nothing's happening and that's because we're using the camera on the MacBook now again you could uh, do this vice versa and you could even use both cameras at the same time meaning both people can use their cameras and you'll see that um, you could do straight up video calling just like FaceTime yeah now one other really cool feature before I sign off is that you can do screen sharing on the computer and um, show it on the iPod Touch. So I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to go over here to share screen, share full screen. I'll press OK. And you'll notice right here that we are sharing our screen right now. And you'll see that on the iPod that we are sharing this, uh, we are seeing the screen share right now. So what I want to do is I want to go navigate. We're going to do this. There we go. And we are going to navigate the computer just to show you that screen share does work. As you can see, I opened up Google Chrome and it opens up Google Chrome there. Let's click on uh, YouTube. Um, and it should open up YouTube there as well once it loads up on my computer. As you can see, it pretty much follows the... Uh, computer screen um, there is general lag of course this isn't perfect so don't expect to watch YouTube videos remotely this is just a way to you know show somebody something on your computer not necessarily to stream videos so that's really it I'm Kenneth Bolito from the tech guide I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video please rate subscribe and comment and I'll see you guys later